Hey, hey, hey everyone, my name is Nolan and welcome back to another Pixel Gun 3D Top 5 video. And today we'll be counting down the top 5 most useful heavies. And I know a lot of you guys are probably like, what the heck does that mean? Well, the last video, or top 5 video I made, was top 5 heavies in general. So those are like the heavies that like you would use to get kills, or just like the 5 best heavies. But, you know, th that didn't really include rocket jumping or stuff like that. So if you wanted, like, heavies that could rocket jump or, like, heavies that could group together enemies, that will be this list. If you want to see the first part, the link will be down in the description. Also, two disclaimers before I get into this. This list is entirely my opinion and is subjective to change depending on what you guys think. And also, I will not be reviewing any heavies that I do not have. And yes... Finally, I have Bomber Cat. All right, and with all that out of the way, let's just jump right into the list. So number five um, is, in my opinion, Eraser, because this heavy is really good at grouping together enemies for raids, monster sieges, what, whatever. It's just really useful if you need to, like, for some reason, group together large amounts of enemies or whatever that may be. And it also has pretty good damage. You could also replace this with Border's Eraser. However, this one's damage isn't really as good, and also it's... Uh, gravitational pull does not last as long and actually same with the mirror although its damage is probably a little bit better and it does have more perks it's still its gravitational pull does not last nearly as long as eraser and because eraser is on this list because of its gravitational pull that's why i have this one as number five but it could be replaced with mirror or mirror -er, wow or borders eraser all right, number four on this list is Earth Spike Spell. D despite this actually being good for damage, it's also pretty useful, especially when you want to do like multiple categories of three cat. If that makes sense, like if you wanted to do five cat or six cat, you could use this for damage. It's really good for spamming with Aphrodite's crossbow. It does pretty good damage, but it's also really, really good in raids. This is the heavy I use in raids because it's really good for taking down monsters. And it's also really good if you need to a wall so that way you can respawn somewhere else. So yeah, I really do like this one. It's pretty useful, and that's why it's on this list. Also, it's cheap. You can get it with 500 coupons in the gallery, I'm pretty sure. Or you might be able to buy an armory for coins, which a lot of these weapons are not like that. Alright, number three on this list might be a bit unexpected, but it's Submarine Drone Station. And this is because this weapon has actually pretty good damage. Um, and it also has this weird thing where you can like see enemies locations It has like a radar and it scans and it shows you where people are So if you need to find somebody like in duels flag capture whatever You can easily find them with this weapon and then dish out pretty good amounts of damage I'm not gonna lie So that's why I decided to put this one on the list because I actually used to use this one quite a bit And then just forgot about it So I, I feel like that it should be on the list although it a lot of you might disagree with me on this But that's all right. I I still really like this weapon Okay, number two on this list is honestly a two-way tie between two weapons. And hear me out, hear me out. I know that sounds crazy, but I did a two-way tie because I wanted to put Royal Ashbringer and Demolition both on this list. And honestly, they're very, very similar. Royal Ashbringer has a higher fire rate, lower damage, and it also has a little bit of a lower rocket jump, or maybe you just fall to the ground quicker. But Demolition Skeleton has higher damage, lower capacity, lower fire rate, but also a little bit of a higher... Um, rocket jump so if it just depends on your playing style if you really want a higher rocket jump um, then go with demolition exoskeleton but if you want more capacity higher fire rate and you don't really care too much about a higher rocket jump definitely go with royal ashbringer it just depends on how much on how, what, what you want really I mean um, I prefer demolition ex exoskeleton because I usually don't find myself going through all four shots in one life but sometimes I definitely do so it does kind of pay off to have the extra ammo with Royal Ashbringer but I still prefer the higher rocket jump and higher ammo or higher damage sorry with the demolition ex exoskeleton so I do prefer that one however they are both really good and it really just depends on your playing style and so I really wanted both of them to be tied for number two Okay, number one on this list def definitely has to be Bomber Cat, and this definitely would have been on the last heavy list had I actually had this weapon for that video, but I didn't. But I have it now, and so it is going on number one for most useful heavies, because not only does this weapon have a really good rocket jump, but it also has really good damage. In fact, I feel like it just combines the last two weapons. It has moderate ammo, moderate rocket jump, and then pretty good damage. So honestly, this is probably the weapon I would go with for pretty much anything. If I wanted a good rocket jump, bomber cat. If I wanted a good weapon that can three cat, bomber cat. If I wanted a good damage heavy, bomber cat. So yeah, this weapon is just all around probably one of the most useful heavies and 
really just one of the heavies that you'll probably end up using the most. So if you can ever get your hands on it, highly recommend it because it's just all around a heavy that you should have for pretty much anything. I mean, obviously it's not the best spamming heavy, but still it's good for pretty much everything else and I highly recommend it. The only thing that it's not really good for is doing damage to yourself. So if you wanted a weapon that does that, yeah, Earth Spike Spell is definitely the way to go. But otherwise, Bomber Cat is definitely definitely the best weapon you can get on this list. Okay guys, that's going to wrap up the video there. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, or maybe even just found this helpful if you're looking to get a useful heavy. Maybe you wanted to see this list so you had some ideas on what to get. I'll, I also hope you guys agree with me. If you feel like there should have been a weapon on this list, let me know what that is down in the comments. Also, while you're down there, let me know what the next top 5 should be. I know I've done snipers, and I think I even did like... Uh, weapons that people don't know about or something also don't forget to check out the other heavies list um, because there were other ones on there obviously like dislike and frozen heart and stuff so go check that out if you want to see that and yeah again thank you guys all for watching i owe it all to you guys uh because you guys allow me to make these videos and yeah i will see you guys all in the next video peace